and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over my Blitz predictions, my Blitz player predictions, my pretty much, let's say, Blitz scheme predictions. Like, how do I think they're going to go about this? What they're going to be doing, the players are going to be using now. I went over what to have to prepare for it. That's all coins and other stuff. This has nothing to do with all that stuff. This is strictly going over what I think we'll see, how we'll see it, and in what order that we'll see it. Now, they did kind of confirm two things, I believe, on stream yesterday when watching. I think Kralo pretty much said it, but we have to wait and see to see if that's actual, actually factual, but I think it will be. So, I have a few predictions that might not even be predictions. They might just be factual, but we'll get into all that as the video goes on. Now, it is, I believe, a day away, right? Thanksgiving is tomorrow, so the Blitz should be, we should know most of it by tomorrow night at 8 p.m., Maybe even closer to midnight. But with that being said, I feel like today's the last day. So let's get over all the predictions. And we can come back to this video like in a week. And you guys should all talk crap about how wrong I was. But more than likely, I think I'll... I have a pretty good sense of what will be coming out. So I think that we should be okay, guys. By the way, for... You know what's funny? Just real quick. I think this LSU jacket and... My LSU jacket and the pen that I have has gotten me more comments and, and mentions than I've ever had in my life. Just want to mention that real quick. I cannot go around anywhere with this LSU jacket without people saying some crap to me, whether they hate this team or they love college football. And I don't even realize. I mean, it's just like a purple jacket, but like, if you want to get that out there. Guys, before we get into this video, real quick, if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on that noti bell, come join the family, boys. We are about 60 subscribers away from 13,000. So guys, everyone watching this video right now, hit that subscribe button. Let's get there as quickly as possible. Maybe by the time you guys see this, we already hit it. But thank you guys for all that. Thank you for everyone who's new. You won't regret it. Make sure to comment down below what you guys think of my predictions. And comment down below your own predictions. Like who you think the master will be. Who do you think they're going to go about with all this. And if you haven't already, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get this video to 300 likes? You guys have been smashing the like button lately. And that's it, guys. Let's get into this video. So, first things first. Blitz. It's going to comprise of probably like eight different players right eight different players that you're gonna be able to build maybe 10 last year there was quite a few there was like tyree kill i, I mean well, in the years past i've seen tyree kill i've seen aaron donald i've seen ryan ramsey or armstead i mean i've seen and maybe anthony Barr. there's been a lot like it just kind of like changes up there's been a uh, bud dupree there's you i'm gonna say there's about eight there's gonna be probably about eight players a bunch of packs a bunch of like lower packs and then a master now, guys, one thing that they did confirm on stream yesterday, which I think is pretty much that, is that when we were watching the Team of the Week stream yesterday, we saw everyone was tweeting at Qua uh, Kralo and, like, messaging him in the chat saying, what the hell, no Lamar Jackson again? No Marquise Brown? And Kralo said, for all you Lamar Jackson and Marquise Brown guys, don't worry. Like, 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 don't, like relax, don't worry. Pretty much stating that they will be coming, and I believe it will be during the Blitz, right? Because, so Lamar Jackson, back-to-back -back weeks, or, like, in back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back weeks, has had three to two worthy performances of a Team of the Week card, and he definitely deserved it. He has not gotten a single card yet since his other Team of the Week card. So, usually what that means is, in Madden history, what that means is when they do things like that is they're holding them out for a promo. Now, another guy who's in the same boat is Patrick Mahomes. Patrick Mahomes has not gotten a card since, like, the first week of Madden with the, the Superstar thing. So, if I had to guess, I think Pat Mahomes, Lamar Jackson, and Marquise Brown will be getting cards. Now, Marquise Brown might be like a... Just a regular blitz card, like an 86 blitz card, you know, 30 keys, you get them. Now, Lamar Jackson or Pat Mahomes, I think one of them might be the master. Possible. Usually, in years past, they put Legends as the master, so I could be wrong on that. Like, the top piece would be like Aaron Donald, 93, which could be that good. It could be Lamar Jackson or Pat Mahomes, like a 93, and then the master or something else. But maybe they change up this year because... I feel like Lamar Jackson blitz master would be awesome, but in years past, they've done Deion Sanders and Night Train Lane, from what I remember so that makes me wonder will it be another legend now they already given us Deion Sanders they've already given us Night Train Lane so it either have to be someone different entirely they've given us Barry Sanders they've given us all the legends that we're used to seeing around this time of the year so I really don't know who it could be right Emmett Smith we got already Barry Sanders we got already Night Train Lane we got already Deion so it was kind of weird so could they change it up this year and give us a current blitz master i think it's possible i think it's quite possible we, we see one of two things we're either going to see a lamar jackson a pat mahomes as an ltd a blitz master or the top blitz player besides the master now guys if one of them is the blitz master you have to anticipate that this is going to be a very very expensive 
expensive card to get. So the way it'll be like, it'll be so much like the harvest where you go in here and it'll be like blitz and right here will be like set of Thanksgiving day also it'll be like blitz cards and all the cards are limited. Remember that they're like not limited time, but they have a limited time limit. So like they're not as rare. They won't be priced like a limited time, but they will, they will be like between hours. So like it'll be like from 4 PM to 12 PM tire kills out. You have those hours to go do the collection form and get them. And then once that ends, that's it, he's out. However many were made or how many are made. So that's all up to you guys and how many, pretty much however much people want them is how many of them will be made. So it's not like that there's rarity based on them. But you have to understand that with that being like that, you're gonna have to get the cards you want when, you, when they're out. And if not, you have to go buy them off the block, which usually is not the worst idea either. But in, if that is the case, that is how you get CD, that's how you get the CDs and stuff for the master. So if you want the master, you're gonna have to be doing a lot of those players. So if, if they are one of those players, like the players that are timed, they're not going to be that bad. They won't be too expensive. They'll be kind of expensive, but they won't be crazy expensive. But, but if they are one of the masters, they're going to cost like 300 to 400 dollars more than likely, which is going to be crazy. Now, and then also next to that, they'll probably be like, uh, the blitz tokens for packs. They'll be like packs, players, and stuff like that. It's very straightforward the blitz promo. But again, I think those should be the masters. Now, other cards that haven't gotten upgrades yet. A lot of cards at this point have gotten their upgrade yet. Now. Like I said, I think the surefire ones that like, we could really anticipate that they'll be getting a card has to be Patrick Mahomes. Kelsey already has his card, so I think I think Pat Mahomes, Lamar, and Marquise Brown are pretty guaranteed. There's quite a few cards that haven't gotten any upgrades yet, but none that like I think would get a blitz upgrade. Not a lot. Like Aaron Donald's got one in the past. The kickoff players are weird, so I think that like DeAndre Hopkins or Khalil Mack potentially, but they have those kickoff cards. But those kickoff cards are dead in the water, which kind of sucks. That's what kind of sucks about the whole kickoff thing with them, that they kind of killed four power-up trains of cards that just people can't afford. The Master is what's perplexing me at this point. I really think that the Master, I think they could change the trend this year. And if they do so with changing the trend, that'd be very awesome for us because, I mean, kind of awesome because at least we'll know, you know, they'll change it up for once. I don't just want them to throw in any legend. I mean, if it's going to be a legend, at least make it really cool. You know, cool. a Calvin Johnson wide receiver would be cool, but I doubt they'll do that. They're definitely saving that for something else. As a whole though, as far as my predictions, now I'm getting to like the, the bulk of the content. I think that there's usually a time schedule. From what I remember last year, it was, it was 12 8 4. I'm pretty sure it was 12 8 4, which is weird because I was also hearing that it was also 8. So I remember that at midnight, there's offers. At 8 a.m., there might be offers. And at 4 p.m. So I'm pretty sure that was the schedule, but then I'm also pretty sure there was packs at eight. So that makes me wonder, was it every four hours? I don't think there was six times in the day where you can get global limits, was there? It wasn't, it wasn't 12, four, eight, 12, four, eight. Was it, was it 12, four, eight? No, 12 to four to eight to 12 to four to eight. Was there in the afternoon? I don't, that's what I don't remember. So if you guys know, comment that down below. But besides the point, there's typically intervals. So expect intervals. So guys, for all you working men, for all you busy women and men i should say because i don't know my i don't know my exact demographics here but for all you guys who work who have families who have lives and especially on thanksgiving is gonna be the hardest one black friday everything's typically within four to eight hour intervals so you guys are gonna have to be here on the spot to play these so you're probably gonna end up missing a few somewhere in the middle of the night so i know you guys work you're not gonna want to you know ruin your whole sleep for this you know with your families and everything but so it won't be the middle of the night so it'll be like right over here you come over to solo challenges it'll say like blitz solos and there'll be a timer like three hours and 15 minutes remaining. So you have between that time and that time to play them. Now the global impact, you don't have a time limit. That's like, you do it in that minute or you're done. At least the solos, like if it's 4 a.m., you could be like, okay, I'll wake up at like 7.30, I wake up a little earlier, or 6.30 for work, I'll wake up a little bit earlier and I'll go play it real quick. But the packs, you can't do that. The packs are like, they come at eight o'clock, let's say, that's it. Like you come to eight o'clock, you're either there or you're not there. So for all you guys who spend money and everything, here's my best advice for you guys. Have about 5,000 training ready to go. Have about like 20 bucks maybe worth of currency to go. See, the Fire Fantasy Packs though, people say they don't go that quickly only because they cost money. The things that are going to cost real money, people sit there for a bit and think like, should I spend the money? Should I not? They think about that. The coins and training people don't think about it. Like if they see a Fire Fantasy Pack for coins and training, they're buying it. So understand that the ones that have coins or training or anything else, those will go in seconds. The ones that have currency, like last year the Fire Fantasy Pack came out, I thought about it for like 15 minutes. I saw it going down slowly because it'll be like 15,000 available. It goes slowly down. 
it ended up going pretty fast not gonna lie it went pretty fast considering how many packs were there but i had time to think about it i was able to think and really think about is it worth spending my money on so at least in that aspect you don't have to like fly for it right that instant but i could be wrong maybe this year more people people are willing to do it i mean this was last year we're talking about the first place maybe everyone wasn't ready yet but i guess i'd have a, if you guys are gonna plan to spend money anyways have like 20 bucks loaded up maybe 30 bucks loaded up have your training ready to go because like i said when things come out there's no i'm gonna be honest with you guys there's no time to get to the auction block like oh there's a fire fantasy pack for 4,000 training you're done you're done like it if you're saying that in your head you already lost if you're reading this it's too late if you see that you don't have enough training and a fire fantasy pack comes out for like 5,000 training just take the l you're not going to make it to the auction block last year i sometimes didn't even make it to the store i like let me show you guys let me show you guys a real estate and people were asking by the way sorry to cut myself off actually people were saying how do i prepare for the blitz like do how do i get so you how do i get the packs when they come out at 12 like do i have to quit mad no you just back out like this i'm gonna show you guys real quick because you guys were asking you back out so right now it's like and 12 p.m once it hits like 12 midnight click ultimate team now right here this is gonna freeze i'm already telling you if it's, it's gonna freeze the first time people are doing this it freezes it crashes it can't load and then you get to the store right you're super hyped you see it right there fire fantasy pack and you click it you go like that's like unavailable 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 and gone zero that is how frustrating it's gonna be so you guys know you're on your game be ready get get all anxious get ready to go i'm telling you it's not gonna be that simple it's it's not gonna be easy i've i've made it there in time if the game's freezing it's crashing people are hundred thousand people on the servers right now it can't hold everyone it's freezing up trust me it is the most frustrating thing and then it says zero and you missed your offer and now you're pissed off it's not fun but i think that pretty much wraps up what i was trying to cover there's intervals the packs and the keys how to do it solos and who i think the masters players and some of the cards can be like i said the ones i think are sure i think we can get mahomes and lamar jackson as two guys that could potentially be a master or a top piece as far as everyone else can we get like a Tredavious white maybe i could see a Tredavious white he did get a six year but i could see a Tredavious white as one of the top pieces i mean there's a lot of things i could go here the blitz is just it's like it's its own realm like it just does its own thing so we have to see how this goes but um pat mahomes or lamar jackson would be pretty awesome could you be investing in lamar and pat mahomes power up sure but i'm pretty sure people already started doing that because people have an idea lamar jackson power ups are going to play like 180k now so that, that tells you all i need to know but guys that is about it for the video hope this does help you guys a little bit understand i did i think i answered a lot of questions pretty much is what i did i answered a lot of questions from yesterday like how to get into it who can the masters be do you think it'll be lamar i think i answered a lot of things that were asked me like asked of me for the last few days so hope this helps you guys thank you guys for watching hopefully you watch the other videos i post today there should be two others thank you guys if you haven't already make sure to hit that subscribe button hopefully by the time you're watching this we already hit 13k and if we haven't make sure whoever's new to this is pushing us over the top and make sure to comment down below what you guys think give me your predictions for players down below i want to see what you guys are like what's the consensus and also smash the like button can we get 300 likes in this video i'm out see you guys in the next video peace